almost 11 right now. I have to study a chapter for biochem. I have a test coming up, so I have to start studying for that. I started studying for that test yesterday. It's five chapters, so... I gave myself more time than usual to study for it. I also had to start working on a lab report, so I'm gonna do that. So here's my planner. This planner is from Moji. I don't know if this will help you find it, but it's the A5 Monthly Weekly. I got this in person. I'm pretty sure I tried to find it online so I can link it for you guys. And I couldn't find it, so I'm not sure if it was only in stores. I like to put stars in when I have exams. This is actually a pretty empty planner. I also like to do to-do lists, but um, I haven't done that yet. And then... Uh, I like to put here on the side which chapter I'm studying that day. My notes app, this is kind of what it looks like. It's kind of messy, but as you can see, I kind of planned out what chapters I was already going to study. I kind of wrote as well, like, what I'm going to do. So, for example, for today, Tuesday, I have that I need to do chapter 11, and then I also have that I need to start my lab report. I feel like the notes app makes everything so much easier. I'm going to show you guys another week. This is right before midterms. This is kind of how I planned it out. Finish lab report and then I like put what my specific goal is. I like I had to edit a video and then I wanted to finish by 10 p.m. because I was gonna wake up early. I think I woke up earlier this day but that's basically how I plan my things out. I just like to make a whole to-do list on the notes app and then I use the planner um, for deadlines and then I make this list based on my deadlines. I've also been using this little to-do thing here from this extension I use. Um, let me find the name of it. So it's called Momentum and it's a Google Chrome extension so I've been using this for like a long while now. Um, it's my favorite. It's what gets this pretty screen here and you put it in the settings where you want it to be like the first thing that pops up. So if I open a new tab that's it. A lot of you asked how you get that tab. You just click the to do here and it pops up. I just finished doing a quiz so I marked that off and it refreshes the next day so this like goes away the next day.
So I was reading some of your comments, so I'm gonna give you guys a quick room tour because I feel like you guys have been wanting a room tour for so long and I feel like there's not much to it, so I'm not gonna make it a whole video. I've never done a room tour before, so I have no idea how I'm gonna do this, but the first thing I have here is this. This is from Ikea. Most of my furniture is from Ikea, so just letting you guys know, but I'll make sure to tell you guys in case it is or not. This glass top is also from Ikea. I have a lot of like little plants around my room. Most of them are from Ikea. I think this one is from TJ Maxx. Um, they're also all fake. And then I have this thing here. I think I got this vase either from Target. It's definitely Target. It was for flowers and then I just have like all these like old letters from this thing that I used to keep here that you could just like put words. And then I just have my TV here. And then here is a mess. I kind of hate this, but I don't know what to do with this. So this is just how it is. I have my books here. The bottom ones I've read already. And then the top ones are the ones I want to read as well. I have this light. It was gifted to me. Um, I'm pretty sure you can find it on Amazon if you put like star projector. And then here I have like incense. I don't know why it came in a white sage thing. It but different incense types and then I have my MCAT uh, books here which I have not started and then here's a mess this is that book bag that a lot of you guys asked me where it's from it's from this brand here um, but it broke which was why I didn't recommend it to you guys it like completely broke inside here and they kind of just told me oh that sucks so I was <laughs> that was really upsetting and then I have a laptop cover in case I want to take it anywhere because it doesn't have a case and then I have this kankin I kind of take sometimes um, to the beach and then I have this little cubby here this is probably the messiest part of my room I don't even want to show you guys that because it's so messy um, but I have this other fake plant also from Ikea I have my old laptop here I mentioned in another video I wasn't sure that I was gonna to be getting a new laptop so i got this for christmas which is also from amazon i got it in silver because it would match the laptop my laptop's now black so it doesn't match so i just kept that there i don't use this laptop because it has no storage for anything and then i have my play button here i want to hang it here um, I just haven't had the time yet, and then I have this little thing here as well, which is also from Ikea. Now we have the part that I show in 90% of my videos. This is my study area. This is literally where I spend my time most of the time. I have this floating shelf, which is also from Ikea, and I have my desk. My desk is from Costco. Um, I think the brand is Trisanti. And then I have this lamp. I really want to change this lamp because I feel like it doesn't fit the vibe as much anymore. And I think it's very bulky. So this one's from Ikea as well. And then I just have my Alexa there. My chair's from Amazon. I have my little setup here. I get a lot of questions on my laptop stand. It was gifted to me, so I have no idea which it is, but it's from Amazon. I'm so sorry. I feel so bad when you guys ask me where my laptop stand is from because I really don't know. It was sent as a gift, and I don't know which it is. My laptop is the MacBook Pro. It's the 16-inch one. This is also from Amazon. And then my keyboard is the RK61. Um, these are the red switches. Honestly, for typing, I wouldn't recommend the red switches. It's probably better for gaming. If I were to get new switches, I would probably get the brown switches. I have my pens here. Honestly, I really just use this pen, which is from Muji. It's this one. It's the Smooth Gel Ink Ballpoint Pen. My sister gave me this little AirPod case, but it's from Smoko. I'm pretty sure they sell it at Urban Outfitters or Amazon. And then here my room gets kind of a little messy again. Well, I have this mirror, which is also from Ikea, I think. And I have this vanity desk thing, which holds a lot of my makeup. I don't even want to open it. It just has so much makeup. This little vanity thing with the glass top is also from Ikea. I keep all like my jewelry there. It's kind of messy. Don't know what to do with it. I have this little mirror here. Don't know where it's from. I think it might have been Costco. And then by my bedside, I keep... This is like a spray. Um, if you're Brazilian, you know exactly what this is. It's like a honey spray. And then um, I have melatonin. And then I have my glasses, which are from Warby Parker. And then I have the selenite lamp that my sister got me. I just have like my bed under my window which is what I've been wanting also my bed is not aligned right now I'm not sure why I think I accidentally pushed it for something this blanket is from Target I got it around Christmas time so they have like 
it's like green under i'm pretty sure that my furniture is from the mom collection and then the last thing i have in my room is this full body mirror this mirror is also from ikea so that's my little room tour there's not much to it but i just wanted to show you guys because i was looking at some of your comments and you guys said that you wanted to see my room 